Now to the weather watch and a live look at the Chicago River and it looks spectacular and another nice day out there. Steve's here with an update on our forecast. Steve. Rob, pretty as a picture around a lot of the area today. And you know what's really nice to get temperatures around 80 degrees again. Finally feeling and looking like summer. Look at all these 80s we have on the map and cooler, slightly cooler around the uh, lake. So 81 degrees, typical of the weather in DuPage County. Margaret checking in and she says along with that 81 degrees, 59 for the dew point. So a little humid, just a bit. And there's a nice mixture of clouds and sun. And these aren't threatening clouds, by the way. You can see that they are uh, the white clouds, bright and some cumulus clouds that give us a nice look. And 77 degrees, maybe you're coming toward the city. Patrice always checks in with the loop weather. Lovely and comfortable in the west loop today and all the way up from south shore to north shore up around rich and gurney breezy warm day 11 mile per hour winds feels good let's move on maybe you're going out tonight now the later you're out tonight there is a chance of some showers developing more like toward midnight there's a cool front that's drifting down from up north in wisconsin and that's the change that's coming that gives us that little touch of fall for a couple of days but 80 degrees now at o'hare 78 degrees of Officially in midway uh, weather, just like the weather watchers are saying, coolest weather up north and near the lake. Now, with the wind out of the west, it'll be turning more northerly and northeasterly. And the only alert that we have is when these winds pick up somewhat, uh, we could get some beach hazards around Lake and Cook County. So it's not going to be terrific weather for going to the beach, even though it's the holiday weekend coming up. Be careful until Friday. Waves anywhere from four to six feet, strong rip currents, and it's dangerous for swimmers. Uh, for the next couple of days and see these showers are going to be falling apart, but thunder showers are up in Wisconsin. That's riding the front that's coming in this direction. Here's another look at Harvey with those western Louisiana, eastern Texas rain. But here's another thing to notice all the way up through Tennessee now and near Atlanta. We've got bands of rain showers and South Carolina as well. So it's broadening out with those bands of rain, but closer to home front comes through any rain that falls tomorrow should be early in the day. I think most of the day will be unaffected by dismal weather, but it will be cool in the city. We'll have temperatures uh, hugging 70 degrees or so and uh, top off uh, at about maybe 70 to 71 degrees. And I don't even think it'll be that warm on Friday afternoon. So 65 for the overnight low tonight with that east wind blowing. Uh, Friday's weather 69 for a high. Don't be discouraged because just in time for the holiday, 80 degrees for Sunday, 81 on Labor Day. If there's any rain for the holiday, it should hold off until nighttime or early in the morning on Tuesday. I think it should be a mostly terrific weekend. Well, we will take that, Steve. Thanks. Well, we're going to take a live look at Navy Pier right now. And remember, you can get Steve's weather alert sent right to your phone. Download the CBS2 weather app at the App Store or Google Play.